Hello. Hi, hi everyone. Hi, every people. Um, wow. Welcome to the stream. Uh, you know, I wasn't even sure I was going to stream Animal Crossing today. It's a little late, and um, my store is closed. It's getting renovated, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do in the game, but I'll play a little bit, and um, we can also watch the update video. I haven't seen it yet, so I'm going to do another live reaction <laughs> update video. Someone said the update is Pog. Okay. All right. All right. It's not going to be as good as the Mario Maker 2 update, right? Because that was good. That was really, really good. Vinny, I've been watching Red Letter Media's Nerd Crew videos. The satire is melting my brain and it has become smooth. Yes, let them, let you, let them beat you down further. And that way, anytime you're faced with any kind of thing that you may enjoy, you'll instantly ruin it for yourself. Alright, so... Man. Animal Crossing. Vinny, why is your voice higher? This has to be a meme at this point. Vinny, are you excited about the new Animaniacs reboot coming in September? Uh, I could watch some of that. And new Looney Tunes was just announced. Right now on Hoor Island, it's 5.15 on Tuesday. Sorry, Tuesday. April 21st, 2020. Now for today's announcements, thanks to everyone's loyal patronage, business at Nook's Cranny is booming. It's going so well, in fact, the shop has outgrown its current footprint. A remodel is in the works to give our favorite brotherly business duo a few more shelves to stock. The shop will be closed tomorrow to complete the remodel. The drop-off box will also be unavailable. <laughs> so if you have any urgent buying or selling to do, take care of it today before construction begins. Oh, it's tomorrow. No Animal Crossing stream tomorrow, lads. Hope you all have the loveliest of lovely days. It was raining. I don't know if it's raining in-game, but it was raining in life. Not raining. Jacques sent me a letter. When I close my eyes, I can see the most beautiful sunset ever. I wish I could show it to you. The range and depth of colors are astonishing. This isn't helping, is it? Thanks, Jacques. That's pretty cool. I mean, again, Jacques is just cool. Singing songs and being weird and stuff. I like that. Vinny, how did you move your mailbox? You, you press the Y button, and that's it. So that, that concludes this tutorial on how to mail your mailbox. <laughs> on how to place your mailbox. Man, I had one job, and it was a very short tutorial on how to move your mailbox. I couldn't even say it correctly. Vinny, is there a tornado in New York? No, no. No. Seems okay. The flea is under a cup. I never even knew that. Wow, I have... 30 wasp nests in my inventory. What the fuck? Alright, let me place the Goo Goo Gaga chair. Let me do that real quick. And I will watch the update video with you guys. I haven't seen it yet. Um, I, I really don't have room in this hellscape, but here it is. Now there's even more limited movement. Wow.
You can customize the chair. Hmm. How's my favorite prisoners doing? Very nice. Why Pietro? It was a request. Vin, more Final Fantasy 7 tonight. I'm not sure. I'm not- I'm not sure if- if I'm streaming tonight, I'm not sure what I'm streaming tonight. Um... Maybe. I don't know what this room is still. No idea. Time to take a... Nothing. It's the bedroom dinosaur bathroom. Clearly. Vinny, did you already watch the update video? No. I'm gonna wait until a couple more people pile into the stream. Two more people. Alright, three more people, and I'll show the video. No, I'm gonna wait a little bit. Just a little bit longer. Nook's Cranny has been blessed with a lot of business since we first opened up here, but this is no time to sit back and relax. We've got even bigger things in mind. We're expanding the shop again. This might seem a bit sudden, but we'll be closed tomorrow so that we can begin construction right away. Well... Again, there's no, no Animal Crossing stream tomorrow. Um... I know, I know, the whole day with no shop, but we'll see you again in two days, right? Bigger and better than ever. I have no turnips. I forgot to wake up for them, so... Yeah, that's not happening. I forgot to register KK Bazaar. Yeah, no stonks for me. I forgot about stonks. You know, it's weird. It, it became less pressing after I upgraded my house anyway. Ah, uh, good. A place to put... food. Yes. Go away, Timmy and Tommy. Alright. I'll probably see them again, but... Vinny, you sound slightly delayed. No, they sound slightly delayed, and I know why. I have a 300 millisecond delay. Much better. Sorry about that. Now it's good. I'm tired from just watching how busy you are, Snort. Mate, I haven't even started yet. Where's the wasp? Oh man, I forgot. Here, have a baby romper. <laughs> are you kidding me? A baby romper? Oh good, I was kind of regretting that I gave this away. Wait a minute. Guess I'll give this a try right now. <laughs> That's what you get for giving that to me. Thanks, I feel spiffier already. I forgot that he gave that to me. Have 720 bells. Humphrey is now baby. Kinda deserved. Oh, I got the bone door plate. Forgot about that. Fountain. 20 stone, drinking fountain. 
Okay. Jungle flooring looks kind of cool. Could be good for like dinosaur. Dinosaur thing. Well, then the, there's a dig site, so. Vinny slight crust. No one else mentioned the crust. Net, flimsy net. Wait, why do I have a flimsy net? I need a shovel, not a net. Oh well, it can't hurt to make another one, I guess. So wait, what did I need? It was a um uh shovel and what? A, a stone axe. Flimsy axe. There have been some people saying that if Animal Crossing had tools that didn't break, it would it would break the flow of the game. And it's like, wait a minute, you've never played Animal Crossing before, have you? I think, honestly, the best move would be just to have, you know, an upgrade after you upgrade the store. You know, so after a month, you get an upgrade that allows for 1,000 hit everything. That way, you still have the stupid system, but it's not as shit. And I know there's a repair system. I know that you can do a customization and that repairs, but we don't even have a meter. We don't even, we don't know how long it takes for our tools to break over Jacques' head. Oh wait, no, Jacques is, Jacques is good, never mind. Aw, oh, fuck you. Ah. Vine, I'll save you. Don't let go of my hand. Wait. I think I was just dreaming. Carry on, Vine. Get him, not me! Get him! Yes! What the fuck was that? Worst wasps ever. I'll save you, he says. You get iframes when you switch items or talk, yeah. Yes, that's true. However, I didn't expect the iframes to allow me to actually catch the wasps by the time I was done talking. enough wood for the stuff I have to build. Vinny, will you bless my pizza? Yeah, in the name of the uh, father, the son, I don't know why I'm now from Boston. Uh, that had... That was not the proper blessing, sorry. Incorrect blessing. Vinny, when will you start shaking trees? Oh, that's- that's the next half hour of the stream. It's not 4 p.m., but it's- it's close enough. My favorite! My favorite type of streaming from Vinny is when he shakes the trees. My name is Chadley.
I'm sorry if you actually enjoy me shaking trees. It's... It is the most boring part. And then sometimes I don't even get the trees. And then it was all for naught. Vinny, what software do you use to change your voice on stream? Y you... Yeah, I don't I use voice changing software. Oh, well, I'm, this is just my natural voice. I'm like Jim Carrey. I can like undulate my throat. I can, it's fine. I don't, I don't use any software. Now I don't know if they were talking about that, the the funny voice from the filter, or they were talking about how when they first joined the stream, I sound higher pitched. Because that's the theme of the, the past two months. <laughs> Vinny, you sound smarter. That's, that's a first. First time I've ever heard that. <laughs> what? I got that one? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Eggbird, if you want to sing... Did you see that stank side-eye that Drake just gave Egbert? Hey Vine, thanks for saying hi. That's the latest. The sky today looks clear and dry, but that means the sun and moon are happy. Oh, okay, thanks dude. The two weirdo villagers together at last. Um, well, I... The brand new wasp! Is really a wasp? Did you catch it yourself? Thanks, can't wait to introduce her to the other bugs in my house. Of course, we know. The bugs in the walls are always being jerks. Okay. Thanks, Egbert, for that. I'm gonna go join a league. Yay, are you out for a walk? I wanna chat. I'm gonna go real hard today, gonna play hard, snack hard, yell quacko hard. Hey, what do you need? I heard somebody washed up on the beach, so I ran there to go see, and it was just Gulliver sleeping. Ah, oh, fucking Gulliver again? What's up, quacko? Are you rocking a wrestling singlet? Nice, looks easy to move in. Watching you move is making me want to move. It's like, oh yeah, I can move. I forget sometimes. Nice bag you got there, Drake. There's the renovation notice. I want to hear Drac. Drac. I want. I want to hear Drake. <laughs> Yell Quacko <laughs> at the top of his lungs. I guess his name is just now Drac. Do you remember that time I did a co-stream with Drake? And there were several people that were like, Vinny, you got Drake the rapper to do a co-stream with you, and it was just a picture of Drake? Can you guess what I'm doing? I am... Uh, huh, 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 I'm sitting, Quacko. That's, that's so cool. Question, is D.Va still in your town, and if yes, why? Yeah. No, no good reason. There's really no good reason.
now face north. I was hoping you'd come by today. I made a new pattern fabric for you to try out. Man, every day? I don't know how much furniture you customize, but I hope this helps. I'm gonna rock the scoot gear. Hell yeah. No pants. Check it out, someone from any aisle made this. It's even got high-end, cutting-edge, micro-adaptive, sweat-wicking technology. Who, who, uh, what? I don't think it has any of that, Louis. I am now in a metal band that covers only music about Scoot. Cardigan shirt combo. That's that's me. That's, that's me. Kind of have to get that too. <laughs> oh god, really? The only thing that could make this worse is Crocs. No, there are no crocs today. Okay. This is Bowie to Bowie. Can you hear me out there, man? This is Bowie back to Bowie. I'll read you loud and clear, man. Oh, yeah, man! Picking up transmission on David Bowie nipple antennae. Sorry. God, it's- it's so difficult to watch Flight of the Concords and then not fucking spout lines from it ad nauseum. And I'd like to apologize for that. You don't deserve it, chat. I have this exact thing, by the way. Um, this is what I was wearing before I got a surgical mask to wear out. I got, like, three of them. I was gonna wear them to New York Comic Con, and then I, I, uh, I was like, if I wear these, I'm totally gonna be fine. Like, if I, if I wear one of these. Didn't wear it. And you know what? I took my vitamins, and, uh, I stayed the fuck away from people as best I could, washed my hands, lots of hand sanitizer, and I ended up okay from New York Comic Con. Though, I would imagine this year New York Comic Con is not going to happen. And even if it does, I probably am not going to go to it. Here's for, for your stock surveillance room. Oh, thanks, Johnny. A surveillance camera? Also, Scoot didn't put up the camera I got him, did he? Hmm. Vinny, the trailer. After I enter my house, I'm gonna watch the trailer with you guys, definitely. Just give me, like, uh, four more minutes or so. Someone made a good... Ringle design. That isn't quite as blurry, I might put that up. Oh, wow. Operation Scoot Monitor is now a go. All I need, I, I need, um, God, I need... Let me think about this. More security cameras. Maybe some TVs on their own. Microphones. I need to put some microphones up in front of Scoot's house. Hmm. 
No. Michael phones? Like Michael Scott? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, here we go. I just, I figure this is a nice addition to the basement. Don't you, chat? Yes. What's in the freezer? I'm pretty sure you can change your clothing. Someone said give Scoot the wig. Yeah, you can you can get changed from the freezer. Keeps your clothes nice and crisp. I'm pretty sure that was in a movie or a TV show or something. Where someone said that they put their clothes in the freezer because it makes them crisp. So, I don't know where that's floating around in the back of my mind, but it's there. There we go. Now I'm... me. Vinny, was it the movie Things? Did... Did they cover that? On Red Letter Media? Was there a... Review for that with Jay, who was talking about things. That's right, Jay. All right, chat. Are you ready? I haven't seen this yet. I, I only know um, what it's about generally. So here we go. Free updates starting April 23rd. Newly added island visitors. Leafs Garden Shop. Cool. Oh, wow. Oh, shit. Bushes. I don't care. <laughs> it's cool, though. Oh, Red shows up in a boat? That's cool. And I guess here's the fake art. And you have to determine the fake art from the real art. Yeah, cool. Museum expansion. Those bushes do look kind of cool, though. And then you... Oh, the art gallery looks nice. Great. Couple nice little updates. And then Nature Day. So you get, um... Nature Day gives you miles for doing things? Are you ready to go on the tour with your May Day ticket? Head out on a limited time May Day tour. The Hedge Maze. Is that Rover in the background? In honor of International Museum Day, we're holding a stamp rally. In-game uh, rewards through a stamp rally. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, wedding season? These pockets aren't in the game, are they? Aside from this. You can take wedding photos of, of the Pacas, Reese, and, uh... And, and Cyrus. And Tupaca. And Chupaca. Well, I'll tell you what. That's no Mario Maker 2 update video, chat. But I like that. I'm looking forward to the new stuff. I'm looking forward to red. Um... Bushes are a nice addition. Some really cool stuff in there. I want to see what those May Day tours bring and why is Rover on that island. So, I'm happy with that update. That's even more than I was expecting.
I can't wait to see what Red's bullshit art looks like in HD. That's gonna be fun. Hey, Egbert, you wanna watch me shake every tree on the island? No? Oh. Celia, I will return to you when I find a wasp. Thanks, Feathers. I love it. And then, like, I open her closet, and it's just, like, 47 dead wasps. They just fucking pour out. I'm like, wait a minute, I thought you were taking care of all of these, and feeding them, and raising them as wasp children. No, Feathers. No, 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 Feathers. No, 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 Feathers. No! Fe <laughs> Someone said, Vinny, I have, um, high turnip prices in the 400s. Do you want to come to my island? I don't have turnips. I forgot. I'm like, gee, Celia, how did you make this film projector entirely out of wasp carcasses? Well, you know, Feathers, me and Jim Cameron went to school together. Huh. Oh, yeah, I call him Jim. Yeah, we go way back, me and Jimmy. Jimmy Cameron. Way back to the Terminator 1 days. You know, a couple years before I was born. I mean, I've seen all his movies, so I, I we're practically best friends. That's not true, I haven't seen Avatar. But, you know, all of his other movies. Yeah, why would I have seen Avatar? Weren't people getting, like, fucking withdrawals after Avatar came out? There were, like, articles of how people were, like, sitting in their shower with their clothes on because, um, they wanted to live in the world of... What's the name? Ny Nyanimal? Nyan What's the name of the world in Avatar? Nyanimal? Pandora. I was close. Oh, I was thinking of Narnia. Yeah. Close. I wonder how those people would do in VR. Like, the way VR is now, I wonder if they would get the withdrawal symptoms. Because even I was getting weird dreams, like VR dreams. And like... Maybe the first night... I streamed VR stuff. After I was done streaming, when I would look at an object in my hand, like my phone, I could swear it wasn't real. Like, I mentioned this on stream last month, but there were times where I thought I was holding a fake object, and I was like, my hand could go through this, and this object can go through my face. And it was really bizarre, and then I found out a lot of other people um, got that early on with VR. But then you get used to it. And then you pretty much just you know, your mind can separate the things, and, you know, then you, you really do know that anime girls are real. And that's how, that's how VR goes. Yeah, I saw, um, a, an anime girl and a skeleton in VR chat, so... ...and Squidward, so now my brain doesn't know the difference and thinks they're real. You begin to feel the pull of the hallucination. Yeah. Oh, that looks cool. 
so this is new. I built this city on rock and roll, and there it is. Oh, you don't need to do that to plant the thing. You don't need to do that to plant. Scoot is still missing. Yeah, where where did How's my favorite duck doing? Like I have the sign Scoot is missing, but I haven't seen him today, so today the sign is weirdly accurate. Jesus Christ, there's so many trees. People are telling me, like, cut down every tree except fruit trees and two other trees, and that would make my island look like crap. But, God, the temptation. Minus two, that wasn't a Fozzie joke. Uh, no, that was a good joke. The chat, I spent two hours working on that joke. I was thinking about how I should deliver it, say the words, the syllables, uh, when to say it, how to say it, when to eat it. That was exactly the way it, it was, um, it was good. Mm -hmm. I'm a prepared streamer. I stream with the utmost of preparation. Did you know that when the police got back together? <laughs> I don't know how I got onto this tangent, sorry. Totally unrelated, but when the police got back together in 2007, they rehearsed for four months. Every day, for hours. These are three guys who supposedly hate each other. So, like, I think every day. Every day for four months. Uh, it might have been like a day off here and there, but there's this documentary I saw on YouTube that just kind of, like, came up. And it was like, you know, them rehearsing and... You got to see, like, what they did in preparation for that tour. And they fucking killed it when they came back. And these are guys in their 50s, and they... That's probably the best reunion tour I've ever seen. I didn't go to a live show, and I will always regret that. But... That is am amazing. Well, they said as they got older, they respected each other more, and, and they do love each other, but, they were, like, adversarial, and... Sting is a perfectionist, and Stuart Copeland is insane on his drum kit. So... I would assume that they just kind of found a way to work together. And, um, Andy Summers, the guitarist, is, just seems like an all-around nice dude. And hey, Stuart Copeland did the soundtrack for Spyro, so by then, he had the clout. He could say, Sting, I'm easily as good as you, if not better. Did you hear about the Doom thing? Yeah, apparently Doom's... Doom Eternal soundtrack was released, but the mix was not good and Mick Gordon had almost nothing to do with it. Vinny, favorite police album? I've answered this question before and I will answer it. I just need to see the songs on the albums. It's either Regatta de Blanc or Zenyatta Mandata. And yes, these are real album names. Um, probably Regatta de Blanc. Yep. Yeah, that's the one. Zenyat. That's right, chat. Zenyat. It means on top of the world. Zenyata Mandata.
I can't believe that's the actual name of the album compared to how people- Oh look, it's the suit, the bear suit. You made it. Well, did you come to join me in some indoor training? I got a wasp. Wow, wasp. Hey, thanks, I'll be real careful with it. Did you know some bugs can lift several times their own body weight? Yeah, we, we know. Gingham picnic shirt. You hear about Sphinx's extremely sweet title yet? It's freshly delivered egg. The kind of thing I'd call my muscles, except Sphinx's whole body is called that. I'm so jealous. Oh. Sphinx, that's the second time someone told me your weird title. Hey, it's weight training time. Keeping it simple with a cardigan shirt combo, eh? I get it, hoo-hoo-ah. -hoo you don't want to take any attention away from those sublime triceps. Thanks, Louis. They miss Bunny Day. I sure do. They want- they're just dying to tell me about eggs and coconut trees. Thanks for coming, Arthur. What's the latest? I heard you got stung by a wasp. I'm sorry, wasps get scared and lash out if their home falls down. It's hard to run away, but it's kind of your only call, Arthur. Or you can catch them. Hey, speaking of... I know that's a hint, Cookie. I know you want a wasp. I know. A wasp, so cute. Really? Really, though? I was just thinking it'd be neat to get a pet. Here, I'll trade you. It's an explorer tea, and I hear you love the... I... I guess two can play at my bullshit game, huh? I heard you love wasps. And now you give me something that I don't... Ah, oh, it's okay, actually. That's kind of cool. A common butterfly. Get out! Can I ask you a favor? Will you sell it to me for 240 bells? Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, you've made my whole day... <sighs> I've wanted a common butterfly since I first saw one. Alright, have a nice one, Cookie. You want me to say it? Alright, Trey Fantastical. Fantastic Huey. Trey's... Trey's Fantastic Huey. Ironwood, finally! My first fucking Ironwood recipe. Chat. I know people lose their shit over Ironwood, and it's a good-looking furniture set. Drake, run. With his eyes closed. That's how you get into accidents, and that's how you break your quacker. Be careful, Drake. Don't break your quacker. Iron wood low table. Why does it have a wheel? wheel? I, I can make it work. I can make it work. It looks good. It looks good. It's a weird wheel, but I can use that. Finally, a table that would work in my weird house. That isn't cardboard. Chat, what am I doing? Did I just suffer brain damage? Like, did I just have a temporary, uh, momentary lapse of reason? Into the distance, river of black, stretch to the point of no turning back. Yeah, I was blessed with late Gilmore voice. Not early Gilmore voice, late Gilmore voice. Which is the inferior Gilmore voice, in my opinion, but... Someone said that album was an actual lapse of reason. 
Honestly, that's the perfect title for that album. After the very public, very nasty split of Pink Floyd with Roger Waters. Yes, this is a, yet another Pink Floyd conversation within 30 parts of Animal Crossing. But they knew people were going to take the piss out of them. And so they just took the piss out of themselves. I respect that. I don't really respect that album very much. But it's okay. I like learning to fly. I like, um... On the Turning Away. Those are two good songs. I like... Uh, what else do I like on the album? Uh, momentary... Wow, Momentary uh, Bliss from Gorillaz has overtaken Momentary Lapse of Reason as the first title you get. I only like Learning to Fly and On the Turning Away, that's it. I don't- I don't really like that album at all. That's a rough album. Division Bell, however. I will defend that album. I will defend it. It's got a couple clunkers, but there's some real nice stuff on there. And the live versions are even better. Marooned is very good, and, um... I like that Rick Wright got a song. Rick is one of the best members of Pink Floyd, if... He didn't get enough songs. And after Dark Side of the Moon, you almost never hear Rick on a song again. And that bothered me. Vinny, I heard some of their stuff recently. Why are their songs so long? I don't have a good answer to that. Um, but check out The Wall if you want shorter songs. And if you only want five songs on one album, listen to Animals. Four. No, I like long songs. I think they're able to do... Floyd is able to do long songs better than almost any other band. My attention is kept fully during Echoes. Shine On Your Crazy Diamond is a classic. I mean, I have no problem with the long progressive songs, even if it's not fully progressive. It's just good music. I like it. Listen, I know Floyd is totally overrated or like Babby's first ro classic rock band, whatever, but they make me happy. So I'm going to goddamn well talk about Pink Floyd from time to time, especially lately. What about Bob Dylan's 17-minute song? One thing I like about Bob Dylan is he's not afraid to have a song that's over five minutes with one part. <laughs> when I say not afraid, I mean he does not care about his audience. Well, I don't know where that last piece of furniture is, and quite frankly, I don't give a damn. Are you into the doors? Yeah. Um, someone said they saw Scoot. There he is. He's working out. What's up, Scoot? What's up, Vine? You're looking pumped, Zip Zoom. What do you got, Zip Zoom? I have a delicious wasp. Don't eat this. Did you know some bugs can lift? Yeah, I do. I do. Scoot. I learn this every day. Explorer's hat. Wait, what? 
Did they coordinate? Okay, not really. Not really. Vinny, what's your favorite classic rock band? It's it's Floyd. It is the Floyd. Maybe REM? No, it's 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 the Floyd. Least favorite Kansas. <laughs> no, they have they have that one song. Cookie and Scoot gave you explorer clothes because they want to send you far away. No. What about yes? Yes. So, this shark tooth pattern comes from the lower jaw of an ancient shark of the genus Helicoprion. Now, I, I know I'm pronouncing genus probably incorrectly, right? Let, let's find out. Because I don't want the chat to laugh at silly blue humor. You know, toiletry humor jokes, right? Because, let's face it, we're all the height of maturity. And none of us laugh at toilet poopy humor. And I don't make that kind of humor on my streams. We keep this above board. And we make sure every time we're here, we're, we're mature, we're learning. We're having a good educational session every time. Genus. Fuck, it's genus. Ancient shark of the genus Helicoprion. Its teeth seem to have grown in a distinctive arrangement rather disturbingly termed the tooth whirl. I say seem because shark skeletons are made not of bone but cartilage except for their teeth. Consequently, their bodies are never preserved as fossils and questions about their jaws remain unanswered. The size and placement in the stone of the shark's teeth are actually the only thing we have to work with. Sometimes in research, we must maintain a stiff upper lip even in the absence of a stiff lower jaw. That's cool. James Cameron would reconstruct the entire creature using... 30, 40,000 rat corpses. One day, James Cameron's gonna hear about this rat stuff, and he's gonna be like, I don't, I don't have the foggiest idea where something like this could come from. I got the Mila Kunis, the Dunkin' Donuts, the euthanasia. I got the trilobite, the phylobite, the mylobite, the hylobite. Sorry, M&M. M&M took over my body for a moment. The ammonite, the amber. The anesthesia. There it is. Vinny, tell us about your proper pizza etiquette. Vinny, do you like Eminem or not really? Yeah. Yeah, I like those first two albums. When that was a big thing. I, I haven't kept up with it. I don't like hearing about people's beefs with each other. That's... I don't know what that is. Um, I know it's a big popular thing. I'm, you know, maybe I'm weird. I don't really... You know, that doesn't do anything for me lyrically. So, um... So, I know that there was a lot of that, but I really liked some of his songs. I thought he was, he was a good, um, wasn't just about the rapping. I liked the melodies, I liked some of the songwriting, the structure, some of the loops, the beats. Listen, man, you know, I may not, I don't really play hip-hop on the stream. Hip-hop, yes, chat, yes, I called it hip-hop. Um, hip-hop hooray. I don't really play a lot of rap. But I appreciate it when the Gorillaz does it right. And also, I grew up listening to some stuff in the early 90s that I liked. 
it's not my type of music because I, I like melody too, like, a lot, and I look for it. And when I don't find it, I kind of get bored. But I can respect it if it's done well. Wu-Tang? Um, I was supposed to love Wu-Tang growing up because Sha Shaolin, Staten Island. So I was supposed to love them. And I never really got it. I know a lot of their songs because my cousin played it for me. And I, I liked it. There's a couple things in there I enjoyed. Vinny, you should listen to Waguzi. Now, are we sure that's not a Waluigi counterpart? Is that, like, Waluigi's rap name? The only rappers I like are the Hip Hopopotamus and the Rhymnoceros. Those are the two I'm into. Flows like phosphorus. I'm the mother flippin' Rhymnoceros. My lyrics are bottomless. Uh, chat, does anyone know if I missed a tree? You have a- you have a- have a tree? Anyone? Someone said, I like rap a little bit more because lyrics are important to me. And I- Vinny, didn't you say you liked the Spider-Verse soundtrack? I did. They had some really good songs in that. Yeah, I can appreciate it if it's- if it's good, but yeah, lyrics are very important to me too, but I have- it's gotta be stuff I can relate to. And maybe stuff that I- I like kind of more relates to, like, personal exploration. I don't know. Or, in the case of Led Zeppelin, just Lord of the Rings. Do you listen to post-rock? No. I mean, I know I'm gonna get shit for it. I don't even really know what that is. I, I'm sure it's been explained to me, but there's 150-something genres of rock that people recommend to me, and then they're shocked I've never heard of it. Um, so I just don't know. I mean, I like to bring up the Wikipedia article on genres, because it makes for a good time. Meat Step is cool, yeah. I like Meat Step. Vinny, tell me you like The Strokes, please. <laughs> I don't, actually. I've never listened to them aside from their newest album, which I like, so I do. And I think uh, that new album is pretty great. But that's it. Yeah, I don't- I don't know their other, uh, material except for their- the singles. Vinny, do you like Mongolian thrash metal? I'll tell you what, I like the throat singing in Doom Eternal. Vinny, have you ever listened to Croatian algebraic- algebraic dog rock? Oh! Yeah, mate. I love when it goes, arf, arf. That's my favorite song of that genre. It's a good one. Chat, didn't I have something that I needed to get another of? Does anyone remember? Cameras, thank you. Wow, collective memory at work. Okay. 
I knew we would fi- I knew it. I knew chat would figure it out. Wait, 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 it's not called security camera? Surveillance camera. Cool. Gonna need like four of those. A microphone. I don't think I have microphones yet. I don't have, I don't have TVs either. However, I do have D.Va. Vinny, you can't play surveillance cameras outside. Well, shit. Sweet, this is really coming along. What you doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Check it out, I'm making an iron door plate. This DIY stuff takes some major elbow grease, so I like to go all in on it. So worth the effort, though. You want to give it a whirl? Making an iron door plate? I mean, you know. I can show you if you want. Vinny, how many cousins do you have? Like 30? Yep. Are they all named Vinny as well? All of them. This is what happens in New York. And specifically, Italian-Americans in New York. How many own a club? Half. Half. But after this, half of that number. Wait, let's see. We got Club Stank, Spank, Skank, Lank, Yank, Yonkers, Club Yonkers, um, Club Animal. New York's hottest club is Fupa. Brain fart. I was like, what, what am I trying to do? Yep, that's that's now me. Vinny, you should check out some clubs in VR chat on a Friday night. It gets crazy. I, I gotta be honest, the appeal of getting fucked up in a Zoom call or in VR chat. Is 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 too weird? Like being restricted to your couch. That doesn't at all sound appealing to me. Um, no, sir, I don't like it. VR plus alcohol equals barf. Well, I'm sure some of those people are just playing on their computer. You know, I wouldn't imagine everyone is in VR, but yeah, it sounds like a thing that could um, be a little uh, fucking nauseating. I already get a little nauseous depending on what's happening. But yeah, people, I see people on Saturday nights and Friday nights like getting bombed. Just fucking going mental with the drinking. I, I don't judge. That's not for me, but I, I mean, if it makes them feel a little bit- Listen, whatever the fuck it takes to feel a little sane right now... 
you know, you're drinking at home with your friends on a call, that's, that's fine. I like to walk around, you know, like I like to be able to move around within social circles if I have a couple drinks. I like to be able to go outside, um, get some air. It wouldn't, it wouldn't work for me. Someone said not all coping mechanisms are healthy. Correct. Correct. But, I mean, I'm not gonna judge. I don't know, like... If it's a once a week thing, people are just having fun with their family and friends. Eh. I, I won't judge, you know what I mean? Well, who am I? Uh, I'm... I'm nothing. Garbage. Garbage. All toasters post toast. Someone in chat said, "Chat, realize what nuance means." Uh, are we taking extreme stances on people drinking in a in a call during a pandemic? Is that what's happening? Well, there's six thousand people here, so. Every viewpoint is accounted for, I'm sure. That's cool. That's a cool piece of furniture. Hang on a second. Um, I want to get the ringles on my drums. Give me a second here. Find it. Yeah, someone sent me the ringles. Where the hell was this thing? Here it is, got it. Alright, cool. I have to go to the store for this. right yeah this this ringles is just a little bit more legible The problem is, I think this is another design entirely, let's see. Like, I think the first Ringle I have is one of the designs that you do with a QR code. NM4V. Oh no, no, this is good. Will this um replace the one on the on the drum kit? Automatically? No. Yes, yes, no. Yes, no, no, it won't. Yes, it will. N yes, it won't. Oh, okay.
Yes, it willn't. I, I love um, that actor, Bruce Willant. What is his favorite thing he says? He says, yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. And what's the other one he says? What's the other famous Bruce Willis line? He squints his eyes when he says it. He, he squints his eyes real, real close together. And he goes, Lilo. Something, I don't know what he says. Ch chat, chat doesn't know either. Weird. This is my own private workstation. I'm gonna run out of fences, aren't I? Boy, that's awful. I'll fix it one day. Oh, by the way, that cardigan shirt combo really suits you. You know what? My noble pants would look amazing on you. Let's have a look, shall we? Noble pants? What can I say? Something about that particular look just screams vine to me. Uh, thanks? A little weird. We meet again, Quacko. I love spring. It's warmer than winter and cooler than summer. It's like a green fall and all the bugs who went on vacation during winter come home and tell me all about their trips. So Gulliver's here. Let's do the Gulliver thing real quick. Marf. You know who you're dealing with? Oh, it's you, Vine. Oh, that's different. I'm slightly less annoyed. Yeah, your phone is broke. Yeah, we've done this. Yep, we've done this. It's like the fourth time, Gulliver. We know the drill. You know, it reminds me of that REM song, Sand, where he goes, Sand, in the place where you... <laughs> Sorry. Why are Animal Crossing streams so minus two? Oh, you, you mean just in terms of bad puns? Bad wordplay. Um... Well, Animal Crossing does it, and it gives me license to do the same. Is my excuse. Yes, I am five years old.
So, chat, if a present is when you don't get something, what is a prez? Prez and present. See what I mean? It's just so easy to make these, these horrendous wordplay. Do you get, like, pre present? No? Alright. Alright, Jermaine? Present? And Murray, present. Alright, the pieces are crammed back in there. Let's see if this thing can send a message. Vinny, when you're doing a thing in Animal Crossing at the same time I am, like, fishing, it throws me off and I pull back too early. Also, doesn't it suck when the music doesn't line up with your music? Alright. Listen, I know this is a shorter Animal Crossing stream. Is- is Jacques giving Drake a massage? While Drake eats a donut? Chat, what the hell's going on here? I don't know what the hell's going on. I got one more thing I want to do. Not that. That was not it. One more incline. Well, not one more, but, you know, one of two more, I guess. Hello, yes, I'd like one dollar, please. Hello, yes, I'd like one dollar, I do. Yep, yeah, I'd like to withdraw. One dollar a day. Thank you. Where do I build this one? Do I, do I build this behind Humphrey's house? have too many trees on this goddamn island. Should have just got rid of it. Get rid of it. Don't need it. The game does not encourage symmetry, so I will not attempt symmetry.
Good enough. Just cliffside obliteration. Yep, that's a good spot. Fine by me. I can make it work. Now this island is is much more convenient. I don't understand why Lloyd thinks a zero bell donation amount is lovely, but you know, you do you, Lloyd. The only thing I can think of with the name Lloyd isn't Dumb and Dumber, but it is The Shining, where Jack Nicholson goes to the bar and says, Hey, Lloyd! Like he knows him. I'm like, how does he know this guy, Lloyd? Played by Joe Turkle. I don't have really anything for you, uh, Celia. You want pants? You want noble pants? Noble pants. Not sure I can pull this look off. I really appreciate the gift. Thank you so much. As a thank you, please take my striped tea. You know, one shitty gift for another. Okay. I am done streaming. Shorter stream. Thank you for watching. Tomorrow there will be no Animal Crossing, as the store will be upgrading. Um, but I may stream later. I'm not sure what I'm going to stream, but I, I may show up later for stream. So if you want to watch some other streamers, you wait here for the auto host. And uh, it'll take you to a whole bunch of good streamers um, throughout the day. I didn't check on my drum kit, so I have no idea if the Ringles took. But we'll find out next time. Thank you everybody for watching. Thank you for the continued support. Stay safe. And see you later.